show. But I've got I got a call from one of our special speakers, uh, Alicia Little, uh, that lives here in the U.S. as well as abroad in Jamaica. And my, how Nadia loves when we get to go to Jamaica. Yaman. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, as a matter of fact, she's like, baby, we're due for a trip back. But anyway, <clears throat> but Alicia called me with a very interesting gentleman. And she said, Dr. Breakthrough, I would recommend you have him on your call. Well, Alicia has um, hands down was the most favorite guest speaker. I got more requests for the replay. I got more inquiries about her. She not just delivered the goods, <clears throat> but her style, her passion. And uh, and so anyway, so when she called and she recommended this powerful de- gentleman now named D. Brown, but especially, listen now, especially when she said, Dr. Breakthrough, <clears throat> pardon me, if Uplift is all about social media, this gentleman teaches people how to take a Facebook Live and to be more effective with the Facebook Live and how to monetize it. I was like, oh, whoa, oh, what's his number? <laughs> Let's give him a call. So Dermal, they call him D. Brown, is a former professional baseball outfielder, most notably with the Kansas City Royals. In high school, he was named an All-America first team by the American Baseball Coaches Association in Raleigh. He was drafted in the first round by the Kansas City Royals in 1996, played for the Royals in parts of major league seasons from uh, 98 to 2004, and he also played for the Oakland Athletics. Um, He also played in Japan from 2010 to 2011, and he's sought after as a coach, a speaker, a trainer, and he has a passion for teaching entrepreneurs and business owners to leverage doing Facebook Lives to build their brands and to monetize their following. And so today he's going to break down the steps of starting your own show, get this now, with you as the star. <laughs> so in essence, he's going to help you to be the star that you are. So the next voice you're going to hear is going to be a voice that's going to empower you, that's going to educate you, that's going to mentor you. And my friend, you want to make sure you have something to write on. Remember, note takers are money makers, but Dr. Breakthrough says action takers are bigger money makers. So D. Brown, welcome to the Uplift family. We're looking forward to learning from you. My friend, the stage is yours. Dr. Stan, and I'm am I good? Can you can my people hear You're me? Good, my brother. Yes, sir. Right, welcome, cool. my man. Cool. Well, I appreciate you having me on, Dr. Stan. Listen, my name, again, is D. Brown, 16 years professional baseball player with the Royals, like my man told, you know, has said on here. Uh, finished my year, my, my playing career in Japan. Right now, I'm a digital marketer where I specialize in helping clients grow, scale, and monetize their business by starting and growing their own show. That's right. You are, I'm teaching people to be the star of their own show. You know, whether you go live on social media or not, You know, I'm going to give you some clarity and strategies that will help you understand the power of running your own show. Uh, I want to get started about, you know, the simple steps that it takes to become the leader in your niche or whatever you are trying to do to educate your audience and become and monetize these lives. So, again, I, I, you know, why Facebook Live, all right? Um, There are 2.3 billion users. Um, active on Facebook as we sit here today, um, and two billion, two billion of them watch Facebook Lives uh, as of 2018. The, you know, there people check their Facebook eight times a day. They're constantly on Facebook. I, I challenge you to sit there, uh, listeners. Li- you know, how many times you, you know, actively are on Facebook? How long you spend on there? You know, who you talking to? And you know, I, I just want you to kind of be on there daily. And just kind of, mon- you know, see, just check for yourself how many times you're checking out your, your, your Facebook page and see what's going on, all right? So the same thing that you're doing, m- many, many millions of billions of people are doing the same thing. So, you know, by saying that, that's why, you know, I started understanding in a digital marketing space when I was trying to build my own brand that, hey, a Facebook Live is something that that's scary at first, but I know the benefit of, of doing it. And... So I started getting on it and, you know, the organic reach and started, you know, just, just speaking about what I know. 
and the following started happening and I started seeing it and more people start, you know, friends of mine or other people started seeing what I was doing and they started asking questions about, hey, how can I get started in this space too? And that's when I started, uh, you know, helping them and grow this, grow their own social media, uh, you know, live show. And so anyway, you know, understand that more people right now are watch social media, you know, YouTube, Facebook, more so than, than watching TV. Um, especially the younger audiences, you know, they don't necessarily watch too much TV no more. They're constantly on their social media platforms, looking at Instagrams and Facebooks, you know, uh, pages. So, you know, why not put yourself, your business, what you're doing in front of them, all right? The, the you know, again, there's 8 million people that watch it daily. It's, it's 8 billion people, I'm sorry, that watch videos on Facebook every day. Just think about that, 8 billion people watch it every day so it, just imagine in your niche in your space of what you're trying to accomplish and teaching and and i'm going to talk about branding and logos and all of that where you could monetize your own show and get in front of some of these eight billion people that are watching videos every day okay um some of the benefits again is you know i i, I tell my clients to so listen create your own logo create your own brand and understand every time you go on in front of these cameras every time that you are you know speaking in front of uh, you know, this audience, they need to see your brand. They need to see your logo. They need to see, you know, they need to identify who you are with your logo, with your brand, with, you know, start, you know, I'll say purchase t-shirts and, and mugs, you know, hats and leave it around your show. So, and, and start wearing it and people will start asking, Hey, you know, I want, I want to, I want a shirt with you got on, you know, can I, can I, how do I purchase a hat? You know? And I tell my guys, listen, sign up for Amazon merch or cafe press. And put it, put the links in front of these people, you know, so they, so your, you know, listeners will start wanting to be more so, you know, like you. I and mean, that's what eventually will end up happening. They will want to, you know, basically buy everything that you sell, especially the value that you're going to give. Okay. Um, again, it's maximum exposure. Facebook Live, I mean, Facebook really encourages live video. They're, they're getting into the space. They want to outbeat YouTube. So that's why they encourage, you know, people to get on, get on live. All right. Um, and then when you get on the live, understand that you actually are creating a platform. <laughs> you are essentially, again, I, I say it, but you are essentially your own show. So, you know, people are going to want to buy, they're going to want to promote your event. You, you, you know, you're going to put different products in front of them. You're going to bring different guests on and, you know, there, people are going to want to reach out to you. I, you don't know how many, how many people reach out to me that just want to be in front. You know, people love to be on camera, you know, as, as scary at first, but a lot of people love to feel like, you know, they're important. And, and who's going to say, hey, I'm going to put you on camera and, and, and talk about your program or, or your, you know, what you got going on, or just let's just talk about our current topic. And people will run to you wanting to do interviews. And I, I'll get into that a little later. But, you know, that's, that's some of the things that, you know, will happen once you start your show. Understand that Facebook Live is not, it doesn't, you know, you don't need, all you need is a laptop or a desktop or an iPhone tablet you can get started um you know and all you need is the internet connection and get onto facebook and you can just press live and go the um you know obviously it's good to be in a good background you want to make sure the audio is good but you, that's all you need i mean to get going and i challenge you know i get in front of them with the right people the clients that want to use um you know my services i just I, I basically challenge them i said go right on just just go live and just start with your story tell people who you are okay um, and then from there, we kind of make sure that you have a business page because you want to look professional eventually. You, you know, you can start it right away, but, you know, I, I just t tell people to go on right, right live and just so they get comfortable and just, you know, talking. But then we, we switch it over. You know, it's great to do it on a business page, all right? Because why, why not from your personal profile? You want to do it on a business page because it's easy to share. All right, from a personal profile, it's hard. It's hard you, don't, you can't share it from your, once you do a Facebook Live on your uh on your profile, but on the business page, once you share it to different, and I'm, you know, in part of the training, I'm going to tell you how to, you know, share it in different programs or softwares that you can share across multiple uh, pages that you, you either own or that you are a part of. Okay. And, but it's good to be part of a business, you know, like a business page. You don't want to be just doing it from a profile because it just looks less professional. Um, you know, going live right now is on, on YouTube is huge, Instagram, Twitter, um, and then there's different softwares that you can use that you can go across the board on one 
Facebook Live, you can hit Twitter, you can hit, I mean, you can hit YouTube, Instagram, all in one. And one of the quick, um, uh, one of the resources that's out there that you can do that with is called Restream.io. And that's great for going across multiple platforms all at one time. All right, that's right. So you can just do one Facebook Live and you can hit YouTube, Instagram, all at once. So I, I'm always, I say at least a handful of times a, a month, I go on Instagram Live and Facebook at the same time and I hit both audiences and the reach is crazy. And I tell my clients to do the same. All right. Um, you know, some of the tips when you're getting started, when I talk, you know, I talk and with my clients and I say, listen, you know, understand that you essentially are a reporter. You, you're, you're your own, you know, you're your own brand. So look the part, you know, sit, sit up straight, make sure you're looking dead in the camera, not down at the screen, but dead in, in your camera, um, you know, shoulders up, Make sure that you present yourself as strong, you know, and you you are you are essentially telling the world whatever you're teaching, coming to you want. So you want to make sure you have, you know, when you first get started, you want to have 20 to 30 topics, okay, that you want to make sure that you write down ahead of time so you don't get caught, you know, uh, what I'm gonna talk about today or what, what's going on. You want to have 20 to 30 topics to start off with, and, and essentially what what you see happen is that. People are going to tell you what they what they want to listen, you know, what they want to hear, and you just got to be kind of, you know, just recognize what questions are being asked, what people are commenting on, and you know, you essentially those twenty or thirty topics will turn into forty, fifty very quickly. Okay, make sure so make sure you're prepared each day with those twenty topics. But then that topic, you know, write down, you know, the three tips you're going to talk about. It may be, um, you know, how to grow and scale my business, and and I'm gonna talk about you know money today and and branding and and logos and I'm gonna have those three topics and I put the three steps to you know monetizing your brand and those are the three things I'm gonna talk about and you essentially say it in the beginning of your of your life. And, you know, and you, you get on there, you you know, you give the description, you tell people like, hey, this is what I'm going to discuss today. All right, you press your live and you say this is what I'm going to dis discuss. Here's the three steps to monetize your brand. And, you know, I'm to give you a little introduction to who you are. I'm D Brown, you know, former first round pick, major leaguer with the Kansas City Royals. And, you know, yesterday was a great show. And today we're going to talk more about boom, 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 boom. And you want to always acknowledge and understand that Facebook is great. Why Facebook is so great is that the replay is, is, is your money. Just like, you know, they say in, uh, you know, in sales or anything, it takes seven touches to get the sale or anything. The replay is great because people, once you speak on there, you know, you get a handful of people that'll be watching you, but then you see the views go up, especially, you know, the more they follow you, they will go up, you know, by the end of the day or a week or two from now, you see those views really grow up I and mean, go up because it's all about the replay. So you got to make sure you cater to that audience. So not only are you beginning talking and saying, hey, I'm D Brown and blah, 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 or I'm Joe Smith and I, this is what I'm talking about today, da, da, da. And you want to put that out there and say, listen, you know, if you're, you know, for the people that are live, I want to say hello. But the people that are listening to the replay, I want to give you a hashtag replay on there and tell me where you're listening in from. Acknowledge them. Let them know. Let's comment where you, you know, tell me where you're calling in from. I mean, listening in from. And you, you go back eventually and you say hello to those guys. Thank you for listening in because you will see, you will hear and, re, and people will comment more on the replay. All right. They, they will watch more of the replay than the people that will be actually live. Um, you know, one of the key to this whole thing is making sure that you know, you engage with the audience, you know, you ask for comments, you ask them to share it, you know, and you, you know, be creative with it. You, you know, this is your thing. You, and it takes a couple of times and the people that I'm sure there's plenty of people on here that have gone live, but, you know, get, get creative with it. I have a little saying where every time I go on, I say I, it just started with me and people recognize that for me as soon as I, you know, it's funny around my town or, or people that reach out to me on the side, they, 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 they understand and say, hey, D. Brown, hey, what's, I say, one, what's going on? What's going, you know, I say that in the beginning and that's catchy to them. I don't, I, I just did it in the beginning and it's, it is just taking a life of its own where we having t-shirts made with my saying. And so be creative, you know, understand that, you know, these people, especially if you're giving great content, they are, you know, they are attaching themselves to you. All right. They recognize you. They want to be part of your culture, what you're, what you're selling, what you're, what you're teaching and, and, they essentially are going to, you know, identify with you by 
you know, you just being the, the passionate person you are, it's not only just sitting there teaching, uh, you know, I heard, you know, Dr. Stan talk and you can hear his passion and, and you, it comes off through a phone or, or, you know, definitely in a Facebook live and they're going to like look forward to hearing from you. And, and it's great. And one of the things is, you know, make sure that you're consistent. Like if you're going to really truly be a show, I tell my clients, listen, be consistent, right? You know, at, every day at, you know, for my sports fans out there, you know, every, you know, day they at sports center comes on at six o'clock and, you know, East coast time in the afternoon or, you know, in the morning, you know, that's seven o'clock, you know, a certain show is going to come on. Right. And if you, you know, not just randomly one time, 12 o'clock, the next, the next day is three o'clock. And, you know, like, no, if you're going to really set the tone and be a real show where I tell my, tell my clients, listen, go on daily where the people can expect to be, see you at a particular time each day. And you, you'll start seeing the views and the comments and people will be waiting on you. I've had so many times where I had, you know, sometimes you go through technical issues and you get people in the background. Are you going on today? Come on. You know, are, are you going on? We're, you know, we're waiting. We're waiting. <laughs> you know, and it, it's crazy. But make sure you are, you know, out there and, you know, every day. And I tell my clients this, you know, and you, you don't have to do it every day. Maybe, you know, we'll devise a plan and we'll talk about it. But there has to be some type of, uh, you know, consistency that, hey, once a week at this particular time I'm going on or, or you know, twice a, twice a week or every day, you know, I prefer, you know, to go on every day. It's just, you know, people, I get hooked on it and people also get hooked on it, okay, that that work with me. Um, the great thing about, and I tell myself, I don't care how many views or anything that's on there, but I'm creating great content. As long as I create got good content, I can use that content for, and I tell people that I'm like, it's for podcasts and and blog post or, or, you know, just using, you know, for social media wise quotes that you may say in that live, they can be used for Instagram quotes. It's, it's one 10 minute, 20 minute average, you know, uh, uh, live that I tell my clients to use is multiple quotes. There are podcasts that can be used and, and blog posts each, each time you go on. And I want you guys to understand that. So don't get caught up on oh, it's only there's only one view or a hundred views and uh it's not enough. And no, oh, it'll gradually build. But each day you go out there, you plug in the way, or each time you go on live, just understand that this content is going to be used. And the great thing about Facebook is always in the archives. The each fan that you grow, understand in the background, right? So you, you into 40, 50 shows, you may catch that new fan because you're acknowledging them, hey, you know, on the replay, blah, blah, blah. And people will share it and start, you know, you tell people to share it and and people will start tagging their friends and everything like that. And these people have never seen you before, but they'll go back and they'll do a, just like they watch Netflix and binge on Netflix. They'll go back and binge on your videos if you're providing great content. So just understand that this is, you're creating great content, you know, how many, every, every time you go on live. So, you know, not only do people seeing you visually and hearing your voice and the logo and the branding and, you know, you are building, if you choose to, you're building courses, you're building podcast you're building other avenues and ways for these people to hear you you know some people just you know can't get around to the visual aspect but they, they'll read a blog post that and just because you are speaking into this facebook live and and they see you, you can extract that content all right it's 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 amazing i i've i've to see that hey i can use one little live one 30 minute live and in and, and, and ebooks and and books and and worksheets and you know all of this is coming out of one live I want people to understand that. All right. One major, you know, component of that is the content that you're building and people will understand that. So more people will hear your message. More people will, you know, want to be part of, you know, what you're building. And I, one of the things that I want to make sure you guys, you know, understand that with these lives, all right. And I'm, I'm going to get into it tomorrow. I know um, this is just a brief overview of the training on, on, on how to start your own show. But tomorrow I'm going to go into the interviewing process because, again, you are a platform, right? Understand that you are a platform, okay? And I talked about it briefly a little earlier, but there are benefits to having other people in the show because other people have audiences and sharing, and that's how you grow dramatically, okay, by bringing on other people. And other people are, are wanting to, you know, talk about whatever they got going on, and, you, you know, you essentially are helping each other out. I haven't had too many people say, oh, no, 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 I don't want to be on the show in front of thousands of people. No, I, I don't, you know, no, nah, you know, I, I mean, I got people in college coaches and people that I bring on are running to come on my show, okay? And my clients are the same thing, all right? I mean, who, again, 
Think about it. That's all social media is. It's all about attention getting, right? Everybody wants attention. Okay. So listen, create this, you know, part of being, and part of my, you know, being a client of mine or, you know, what I'm teaching is that you essentially are becoming the face of your niche, the face of, you know, whatever you are, you know, the business that you are trying to start or already have been uh, into for years. Okay. So, um, tomorrow I'm going to get to an interview and I'm sitting on, you know, I'm going to talk about some case studies that, you know, my clients, you know, that, that have seen great, uh, you know, great progress and seeing their businesses grow just from, you know, the same, you know, social media live, you know, the lives that I've been, you know, teaching them and how to, you know, create and monetize their brands. And it's, 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 it's just a great way to do it. Okay. So doc, I appreciate you having me on. Um, if you want a free checklist, all right, on, you know, basically how to start, and, you know, some free tips on, you know, how to start a, a great uh, live show, all right, go to sociallifeacademy.com, sociallifeacademy.com for a free checklist on how to start your own live show. Again, it's sociallifeacademy.com, and it's a free checklist, all right? It's just a free checklist to, you know, essentially start your own show, all right? Doc, I know that... uh you know, I'm limited in time, but tomorrow I'll get to deeper, and I appreciate you having me on, brother. Hey, all righty. <clears throat> so, folks, are you where I am? I'm over at sociallifeacademy.com. Great information, and, man, I can't wait till tomorrow. As a matter of fact, we ought to double the lines tomorrow because, <clears throat> folks, remember I told you, as Dr. Breakthrough, everybody can't be the CEO. Everybody can't be a CFO. But everybody can be a CLO. What does CLO stand for? Chief Leveraging Officer. See, Archimedes said, if I had a lever long enough and a prop strong enough, I could single-handedly move the world. Why wouldn't you want to leverage Facebook? Why wouldn't you want to learn and leverage these Facebook lives? Why aren't you right now leveraging by going over to sociallifeacademy.com and get the free Facebook Live checklist. Don't fool yourself. People keep asking me, <clears throat> how did you go to the top of seven different, I mean, excuse me, nine now different home-based businesses? It's simple. I learned the power of leverage. While everybody else takes good notes, I do good action. Oh, come on now. So, folks, I'm telling you, he gave you some goods, but tomorrow is going to be extra on and popping. You can't hold this just for you. Get somebody on this line, run over to sociallifeacademy.com and, uh, and get the free download like I've already done. Uh, put your information in there. Just ask for your email. Put your email in there and say, yes, give me free training. 